take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. In the centuries-old tradition that marks the beginning of Lent, priests or ministers rub ashes on a parishioner's forehead in the shape of a cross. Though the ashes were applied differently this year, Label said the practice of sprinkling ashes has ancient biblical connections. Make your mark, take our lead. The churches have not imposed this as an obligatory rule, and the ashes may even be wiped off immediately after receiving them, but some Christian leaders, such as Lutheran pastor Richard P. Booker and Catholic bishop Kieran Connery, recommend keeping the ashes on the forehead for the rest of the day as a public. Take our lead. Church requirements on fasting only relate to solid food, not to drink, so church law does not restrict the amount of water or other beverages, even alcoholic drinks, which may be consumed. In some Western countries, Catholics have been encouraged to adopt non-dietary forms of abstinence during Lent. Make your mark, take our lead. The ashes symbolize both death and repentance. During this period, Christians show repentance and mourning for their sins, because they believe Christ died for them. When the priest applies the cross of ashes, he says to the worshiper, Remember that you are dust, and to dust you shall return, the 5th of March 2019. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell notification.